Walker. In front of me is uh, Asus VivoBook Go and in this video I will show you how to set up a Windows account without a Microsoft account on this device. So first thing, do not connect to the network. And if you are already connected to a network, then either turn off the router that you're connected to or reach the place where the signal from this router is not accessible to you. And then, uh, uh, and then once you do that, uh, uh, go with the following steps. So first of all, use the Windows and F10 combination of keys or maybe sh shift and F10 uh, excuse me shift and F10 combination of keys in order to open the CMD uh, on your screen and then in the following CMD window uh, enter the command double O B E backslash bypass N or O so copy this command uh, input it and then uh, once you're ready press enter and wait until your device is restarted okay and once your device is restarted select the right country or region and press yes then select the keyboard uh, input method that it's right uh, uh, for you and click yes again then if you want to add a second keyboard layout you can add it by clicking add layout and I'm gonna skip this for now then on the following page you'll see the I don't have internet option select it Then you'll, uh, you'll be able to name your device. So input your device name in the following field. Then click next. Then you can uh, come up with a password for your device, but you not, uh, don't have to use a password. So uh, you can click next right away. I'm gonna do this, but if you want to, you can uh, of course uh, set up a password for yourself. Then wait for a short while. Okay, let's try again. Okay, in the following uh, window, choose privacy settings for your device. I usually go with the location as the location lets me know the weather around me and also the local news and uh, directions it's pretty usable since it's the to go laptop uh, usually usually people buy it uh, to use it uh, outside so the location is pretty usable find my device feature is also usable since you can easily find your device is in case it's lost or stolen and the diagnostic data uh, inking and typing and tailor experiences and advertising ID I usually switch them to the left to disable them because uh, they only gather uh, data for diagnostics and basically do not provide you with anything but if you want to you can get to know each uh, setting better for yourself and choose which ones you want to use then click accept and after that your device will be fully set up uh, so that's basically the end of the setup process uh, we just have to wait until uh, we see the desktop uh, menu and at this point the setup is complete so thank you for watching this video if you liked it consider subscribing to our channel leave us a like and the comment below and i'll see you in the next one